Oh, let's do it, everybody. How you doing? James Cebulski, Ray Ferraro for EA Sports, ready to bring you all the play-by-play -play details for this Western Conference collision. Yeah, you can just feel the buzz in this city all day long, and we are seconds away now for this opening face-off. The Wild have established possession here early in this one as they win the draw. Musa quickly over to Nurse. Takes the feed. Up to the challenge as he gets his pad on it. I thought they worked the puck around pretty good here. They get a good chance on goal, but not to be. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. Still no score in this one. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Oh, he gets a piece of it with the glove. We'll get a face-off after the puck stays covered up. Edmonton's got it in the offensive zone. Oh, an unbelievable stop by Talbot. Talbot's able to angle that save over to the corner so there's no rebound. Move to the middle, and that's picked up in the defensive end. Here they come on the attack. Minnesota's regained possession of the puck. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Play is blown dead with the offside. McDavid's biggest asset is his speed, guys. That's his wheel zone ability, and when he's got the space to move, he can really fly, and it's how he loves to create his own luck. The Oilers win the draw here in the neutral zone. And they'll go on the attack after that turnover. Couldn't complete the pass. Moves it to Nugent Hopkins. Takes the pass from the left wing. Makes a move in front. Big time saving goal as he gets all of it with the stick. Yeah, I hate it when I miss chances like this, James. You don't get many that are this quality. You want to put them away because you don't know when the next one's going to come. Moves the puck along the half wall. Here's a short pass to Erickson Eck. Takes a bump but still hangs on to the puck. Grabs it with the glove. Yeah, he makes a nice save here with the glove, as you mentioned, but he's able to hang on to it. That's a tough save from this position on the ice. Nice job tying up his opponent. Great heads up play to poke it away in the offensive end. Moves it over to Nugent Hopkins. Edmonton's got it in the offensive zone. Cuffs up the puck after that hit. Denied that one. Broken up by Greenway. Scooped up along the wall by Hyman. Tremendous blocker stopped by Talbot. And he slides it quickly to CeCe. Oh, what a stick save. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. The Oilers have it now. Slides the puck ahead to Archibald. Puts it up front. Oh, and he'll be shaking his head on that as they were so close. Rask's carrying it ahead. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. Scooped up along the wall by Archibald. Nice zone entry on the left side. Here's a shot. Oh, he gets a blocker on him. What a stop by Calvin. Up along the wing. Puck dumped in. The Oilers gain possession along the wall. And that's some great pressure in the offensive end by Bukestad. Sends a pass over. Here's a chance in front. Big save. Really good work. I like this chance here as they get the puck into a scoring spot. Goalie's just better on this time. Aaron pass and they can't connect. And that's poked away by Cassian. Takes the pass. Quick feed to Perlini. And that's poked away by Hartman. They go on the attack from the left side. And they won't connect on that one. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Hangs onto the puck. Busted up on the play. Now you get in the right spot. Sometimes the thing just hits you. Sturm's got the puck. Handles it along the blue line. Centering pass. Right in the slot, and they can't connect. And here's the pass to Sturm. 
Pass back to the point. Hammers it from the point. And that takes guts to get in front of that one. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. And makes the save. Felino's able to get a shot on net there. It'll be good for him to get involved in the play after missing some time with an injury. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. We've still got zeros on the board. Gets a hold of the puck. And he puts that one aside with ease. Edmonton's got it in their own zone. Minnesota's got possession of the puck. Quick pass to Pugliarvi. Puck grabbed by Stern. And a quick little stick lift and comes up with the turnover. Moves it quickly over to Nurse. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Can't get it to go. Edmonton's got a hold of the puck now. Takes it to the front. Big time stop there. Picked up along the wall by McDavid. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Goudreau. Rask's got it across the line. Right in front with the shot. Play whistle dead. Penalty coming up. Nurse is going to serve a pair for interference. Minnesota's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. The game plan always includes keep this power play off the ice. They've done a good job until now. It's the first opportunity for the league's number one rated power play. Denies the shooter on that play. Moves it to Zuccarello. And that's picked off in front. Nice pass. Minnesota's working around along the line. And he makes the save. And they get the puck out. Minnesota's got a hold of it along the wall. Slides the pass over to Eric Sinek. Here's a shot. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Smith. Can they capitalize on this power play? Here comes the faceoff. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. Slides it diagonally to Ryan. And that's a solid clearing attempt on the play. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Receives the pass. On the doorstep. And a stick breaks that up. Puck cleared from the defensive end. Minnesota's got the puck. Here they come inside the neutral zone. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Here's a clearing attempt, and they get the job done. Minnesota's got the puck behind the net. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Here's a short pass to Eric Sinek. Takes that one right in the logo. And there's the whistle, giving him a chance to exhale. Turris and company still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. Edmonton's got possession here in their own end. And they get the puck out of the defensive end. The Wild have the puck against the boards. And now he angles it across to Rask. Edmonton's penalty killing unit delivers in a big way. Both sides back to even strength. Well, they'll have to regroup after that. The power play doesn't cash in. Opportunity lost for them. Well past the midway mark of this period. The game is still scoreless. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. With possession along the wall. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. And it's kicked away. Moves the puck to Barry. Looks to make a play over to Pugliarvi. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. Sends the pass down low. Moves the puck. From in close. And that's blocked. The Oilers will play it in their own end. Quick feed to Nurse. From the left side, they gain the zone. Quick pass to Hart. 
Chapman. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Slides the puck over. Sends it in on the attack. Edmonton's got the puck along the wall. Barry's stick handling in his own zone. Musa quickly over to Archibald. Steps inside the line. He says, let's get physical on that play. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. The Oilers look to start the transition game. Nice zone entry from the middle. Minnesota's gained possession along the boards. Edmonton's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Loose puck battle along the boards. Grabbed along the board by Nugent Hopkins. Tremendous stop by Talbot. Uh, he's going to feel he missed one there. You don't get many chances that clean. The goalie turns it aside. Edmonton's going to play it along the blue line. Puck picked up by Brodeen. Steps inside. Can't connect on the pass. Let's the wrister fly. And then carries off a stick. Smith's going to hang on to the puck for a whistle. Here in the late going of the frame, still looking for our first goal. Erickson X won the draw. Here's a shot. Denies him with the pad. I think through traffic like that, you're just hoping the thing hits you. From center, they get into the attacking area. The Oilers will play it against the wall. Mervis scoops it up here inside the defensive zone. Sends the pass over. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Edmonton's got the puck in the defensive end. Sends it over to Turris. Moves it around along the half wall. Minnesota's got the puck in their own end. Slides it back to the blue line. Smith's gonna cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. Both teams are set, they're ready to drop the puck. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. Great little poke check by the goaltender there. Here's a chance! Oh, and there's a great save by Smith. The Oilers have it behind the net. Here they come up along the wing. Move to the middle! And that one's stopped. There's the whistle. We'll get a face-off after the goalie covers up. Edmonton's got it, and they're on the attack. Oh, the minister of defense with the block. Picked up along the boards by Goudreau. The Oilers gain possession. That pass doesn't go. Oh, what a stop with the paddle. These are frustrating. You don't get many chances like this. I thought he made a good shot, but the goalie, an excellent stop, beats the shooter. The Oilers take it along the wall. Along the half wall with the puck. Oh, great blocker stop by Talbot. Minnesota's got it in their own zone. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Edmonton's got a hold of it against the wall. Oh, just gets a piece of it with the toe stop. He's sharp on that one. Nowhere to go for the puck. Late goings of this period. Still scoreless in this one. The Oilers take possession off the faceoff. That's a textbook save by Talbot. Greenway swooping in on the attack. Fires it, and he stands tall in goal. Keith's moving the puck through his own zone. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Dreisaitl. Loses his balance on the play. There's the horn, ending the first period. Both teams will have a chance to regroup. You do you, and we'll be back for period number two in a moment.
A chance for both teams to refuel. They are back on the ice, and period number two is about set to go. Still no goals in this one. We'll see if that changes here as period number two is underway. Well, we've got over 20 minutes played thus far. Ray, how have you seen things? Minnesota's focus with the puck has to be a heck of a lot better than it was in that first period. Man, they were a turnover machine in this scoreless game. Battle along the boards. And the puck leaves the offensive zone. They'll be forced to tag up. Takes the feed. Turned aside with the glove. He's not going to face many more high danger chances than that. But he snares that attempt. Lots of time left in this period. We're still scoreless. McDavid's won the faceoff deep inside the offensive zone. Through center along the wing. And reads the play perfectly and picks off the pass. Knocks the puck loose after a solid hit. Fiala's taking it from his own end. Across the line from center. Moves it to Dreisaitl. And now it's grabbed by McDavid. Here's a short pass to Archibald. And just a good old-fashioned solid body check on the play. Greenway's lugging the puck. Minnesota's got it across the line. Edmonton's got the puck along the boards. Here they come. And it's a quick pass to Hyman. Comes up with the stop. Taken along the wall by Archibald. Right to the middle. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Dumps it into the Ozone. Edmonton's got a hold of it against the wall. And now he tries to get it across to Keith. And he slides it quickly to Archibald. The Wild have the puck in their own zone. Directs it on over to Bugstad. Scrum along the boards. Check it along the wall by Felino. And that's knocked aside with the stick by Archibald. And they'll dump it in. Minnesota's got the puck along the wall. The Wild have possession now. Handles the puck. Takes a shot. Oh, what a stop. Scores all over the rebound and tucks it in for the goal. The Wild have taken a one-goal lead. James, we've talked about this enough. I think you've got a one-goal lead. You work hard to make it a two-goal lead. You don't sit back on your heels. Quick feed to Clefbaum. Edmonton's got the puck against the half wall. Mermis plays it now. Oh, great play to use the wall handling the pass. Shot right inside. Goalie with a stop. And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. Lots of time left in this period. Minnesota's up one zip. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. From the right side, moves it up ahead. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. Edmonton's got possession of the puck. Picked up along the wall by Merrill. Minnesota's moving it up the ice. Great reach with the poke check. Quick pass across to Torres. And now he moves it to Shore. And they'll be forced to regroup after the puck bounces out of the offensive zone. The Wild have possession along the boards. Fires it into the offensive zone. Barry's got it in the defensive end. Gets the puck in deep. Minnesota's got a hold of it along the wall. Takes a bump and loses control of the puck. Scooped up along the wall by Archibald. A chance Whoa. right in front. Scores! They've been clawing away at this lead, James, trying to get this game back even. And there's the goal that does it. Nearing the midway mark of the period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Nugent Hopkins wins it in the dots. The Oilers move the puck in the defensive zone. 
Edmonton's moving it into the offensive end. Turns him away. Delayed penalty looming. And the puck's booted away. There's the whistle, and here's the call. This is always a fine line penalty. You're allowed a little interference, just not that much. Guys, this penalty kill is ranked top 10 in the league, and sometimes you think about the other team having momentum on their power play, right? Well, this team can suck the momentum right out of that with how good this PK is. Let's see what happens here. And they send it down the ice. And now it's over to Dreisaitl. The Wild have the puck while under man. And they clear that puck. Scooped up along the wall by Goligoski. Beautiful read in the defensive end by Dreisaitl. Puck scooped up by Dumba. Comes up with the stop. Puts it in for the go-ahead goal. Control the game now. You finally got the lead. You've worked so hard to get in front. Don't give it up now. Minnesota's defense translates into some offense, and they got the lead. Well, when the game's tied, you can't start taking a bunch of unnecessary chances. They've got the lead now, and we'll see if they can extend it before the break. The Wild have gained possession under man. And the puck clears the zone. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. Quick pass to Pugliarvi. Sends it in deep. The Oilers have it now. Streaking into the attacking zone for the right. Here's a chance. Denied by the goaltender. Goaltender covers up and will get a faceoff. Sturm's gliding in for the faceoff as this penalty kill will continue. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. And they get the puck out of the danger zone. Edmonton's got a hold of it along the wall. Looking to break out here on the power play. Musa quickly over to Hyman. Off target. Uh, that's not a very good shot. He doesn't even get it anywhere near the net. That didn't go off anything either, did it? No, that's straight wide. Good check. Freeze the puck up. Tried to connect the pass, but it doesn't go. Musa to Pugliarvi. And he comes up with it. Deep inside his own end, right in front. Can he get out of pressure? Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. Spurgeon's ready to join the play. Edmonton's power play is over. What a disaster as they give up a shorthanded goal. Well, that doesn't go according to plan. The power play's done, and they've given up a shorty. Those are always deflating. Along the half wall with the puck. And that one's broken up. Gains the zone from the right side. Let's it fly. Oh, serves up waffles for dinner with that stop. Talbot's able to handle that shot with no problem, and he gets it into the corner for safety. Dumps it in. Edmonton's got it behind the net. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. Shot, pad save. He's on it tonight. More than half the frame has been played here. Minnesota's up 2-1, and the crowd has been enjoying this one. Edmonton's won the faceoff. Stops the rocket of a shot. Rask's got the puck in his own zone. Edmonton's got the puck. Nice speed at center, moves up ahead now. Minnesota's got the puck in their own end. Spurgeon stick handling in his own zone. The Oilers take possession here in the open ice. They fight for it along the boards. And now he moves it quickly to Barry. Can't get it to go. Minnesota's gained possession along the boards. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Can't catch up to the pass. The Oilers look to start the transition game. Looking for space inside the D zone. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Off a stick. With the stop. Can't find his man. Minnesota's got a hold of the puck. Angles it over to Zuccarello. Minnesota's got it along the wall. 
Here's a short pass to Rask. He scores! And that's two in a row! Get one, you stay hungry, you want to stay on your toes, and while the defending team's back on their heels, they throw another one on the board. The Wild have now taken a two-goal lead here in the second. Ray, what have you liked about their game? I've liked just about everything. I, and I think they've had good goaltending. Their defensive play has been solid. And certainly when you score a couple more than the other guys, you're happy at the offensive end, too. Checking the boxes. Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. Teams are ready for the draw. The line's been about to drop the puck. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Edmonton's in now. Routine save made by Talbot. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. Minnesota's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. And a solid job tying up his opponent. Gains the zone from the right. Minnesota's gonna play it from the corner. Quick feed to Zuccarello. Puck is frozen and we'll get a face off. Ryan's won it off the face off. Good use of the body on the play. And that's a great heads up play in the offensive zone. Tanaisa with the pad. The Oilers will play it from the defensive zone. Takes the feed. Hammers a shot. Denies him with a save. Fogel's on the attack in the offensive zone. Coughs it up on the play. Tries to feed it over to Hartman. And he feeds it down to Polino. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. Denies him with a save. And the puck's kicked free. Pinned up along the boards. And that's broken up. Puck grabbed by CeCe. Gaining momentum up along the side. Felino's got the puck. Sends a pass over. With the stop. Gains the zone through center. Takes the pass. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Here's a shot. Gives them nothing in front. Talbot's goaltending at one end and the offensive output at the other has made for a good night. Here in the late goings of the period, 3-1 is where we're sitting. Fans being treated to a lot of offense thus far. Quick pass to Mermis. got control of the puck. Talbot's gonna hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, James. He needed a cover there. The centermen glide into position. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Nice pass. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. Oh, I thought he was through, James. I mean, that's very close to a completed move, which would have led to a great scoring chance. Moves it quickly over to McDavid. The Oilers played along the wing. And no luck on that pass attempt. Picked up along the wall by Dreisaitl. The Wild have the puck in the defensive zone. Poked away at center by McDavid. The Oilers get a hold of the puck. Edmonton's got it in their own zone. Tees him up, and he comes up with the save. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Second frame almost done, well inside a minute now. Tries to make that cross ice feed. Spurgeon's got it across the line. Minnesota's got the puck against the half wall. Moves it to Turris. 
And now he angles it across to shore. Coming to the slot. Oh, comes up with the stop. The Wild have gained control of the puck along the wall. Receives the pass. And there's the buzzer bringing the second period to an end. You don't want to go home yet, do you? Third period action still to come. Time to drop the puck here in period number three. Minnesota's won the draw. Puts it in deep. Edmonton's got the puck behind the net. Here's a short pass to Pugliarvi. Edmonton's ready to go on the attack. Minnesota's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Into the offensive end now. Good hit to knock the puck loose. And they'll go on the attack. Great pressure by Eriksson Ek. Quick feed to McDavid. From the right side, they gain the zone. And that shot gets caught in traffic. Along the half wall with the puck. Flips it up to net. That's turned away with the pad by Smith. Grabbed along the boards by Eriksson Ek. No one home on that play. Minnesota's got the puck against the boards. And that one's broken up. Great block there. And that's picked off. And he serves it across to Pugliarvi. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Centering pass! Goaltender gave him nothing as it goes off the side of the net. Edmonton's playing it from the side. He scores! But don't turn this one off yet! Well, you better not. We're still here. If we're here, you gotta be here too. The Oilers are back at center ice, probably breathing a little easier now, Ray. They needed to get one, James. If you trail by two for too long, the clock just runs out on you. You run out of time. Steps across the blue line. Edmonton's got it in their own zone. Quick feed to Nugent Hopkins. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Archibald. Stopped by the goaltender. Taken along the wall by Fiala. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Moves the puck. Oh, that's a huge stop by Talbot. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. Edmonton still down a goal here, but they have really picked up the tempo these last few minutes. Taken by Rask. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Quick pass to Rask. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Smith. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. And he makes a save on that play. Takes a shot. And that one's blocked. His reflexes on display tonight. And that's picked off in front. Carries it across the line. Maintains possession. Here's a chance. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Dumps it in. Scrum ensues along the boards. The Oilers have it behind the net. Puck scooped up by CeCe. Across the line from center. And there's the save. Talbot's going to hang on for a whistle here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. More than half the period left to play. Minnesota's got a 3-2 lead at this point. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Minnesota's got a hold of it against the wall. Talbot's got it, and he'll elect for the whistle. Jumped on it pretty quickly there, and like everything else tonight, he's really looked in control. He's had an excellent game. Some last-second communication with the D as centers get ready to drop the puck. The Oilers win it. Moves it quickly over to Turris. Back at the point, they set it up. Picked up along the boards by Bugstad. Moves it to Cuckoo. 
strong defensive effort. Takes a wrist shot. Way too much. Congestion blocks that. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. The Oilers take possession in the defensive end. Into the attacking area from the left side. Here's a short pass to Merrill. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. And that pass can't connect. Quick feed to Clefbaum. Tosses it on to Cuckoo. Puck picked up by Shore. And they continue to apply pressure here. Blocked in front. Edmonton's got it now. Stops him with a glove. Now he looked up to the roof after that one. He thought he had room. The goaltender makes the stop. Sturms won the faceoff. Spurgeon's got it in the defensive end. Handles the pass from the right wing. Great read with the stick. Slides it quickly to Goudreau. Minnesota's in transition. Fires it into the offensive zone. The Oilers have it against the wall. Takes the feed at center and moves up ahead. And he regains control of the puck. Denies him with the blocker. What a stop by Talbot. Sometimes you make a good shot and you just get beaten by the goaltender. I'd say that's one that you put in that category. Now a quick pass to Rao. And the puck skips away after that move. Rao's close to pulling off a great move there. Just denied in zone. Moves into the slot. It's in the back of the net. And we've got ourselves a new game. Always amazes me, James, how one shot changes everything. Now this game is even. Edmonton's been the better team tonight, and they have finally evened things up with the results. It's been a long way to get back to even. And now as we're into the last half of this third period, they've got a chance to win. Nice poke check. Tries to get it to Erickson Eck. Across the line. Edmonton's got the puck along the wall. Throws it in. Minnesota's got it from behind the net. Centering pass! Blocked! Oh, he got it away quickly. The puck just doesn't get to the net. Minnesota's looking to break out. Skates to the crease! And now it's grabbed by CeCe. Slides the puck across to Fogel. The Oilers looking against the half wall. Jostled off the puck. And there's the save. There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play if you're not sure what's going on. Freeze the puck. Past the midway mark of the frame. We are all tied up in this one. Ryan's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Couldn't complete the play. Slides the puck over. Wrists one. Denies him. Here he is with the backhander. Oh, there's one more. Great poke check on the reach. Sends the pass over. And we'll get a fresh set of legs for the defensive pairing as the puck is sent into the offensive zone. Some guys shy away at this time. Others, James, they lock right in. That's when the game is most tight. When it's right on the line and everything that you do is under the microscope. The Oilers move the puck in the defensive zone. Moves it on over to Turris. And now he tries to get it across to Cassian. And he slides it quickly to Clefbaum. Move to the middle. Off a stick and they can't connect. Puck sent over to Dumba. Minnesota's across the blue line. Poked away in the defensive end. The Oilers have it now. Great pressure to force the turnover by Greenway. Gets in front of it. Goaltender covers it up and we'll get a reset here. The setters will glide into the dot. Minnesota's won the draw, they'll go to work. Takes the feed. 
Good use of the body to knock them off the puck. Sends it ahead to Bugstad. And the pass is picked off. Talbot's gonna smother it to get a whistle. Can get dangerous if nobody's in control of the puck. Dreisaitl's speed's effective at distributing the puck, and his tape-to-tape -tape zone ability allows him to make accurate passes to set up chances, and that's why his teammates love playing with him so much, guys. Picked up along the wall by Merrill. Bugstad's taking it from his own end. And now he moves it to Polino. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Stopped by the goaltender. They work the puck into a scoring spot, get a pretty good chance on goal. They just can't find a way to finish it off. Here in the back half of this period, we got a tie game. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Poked away by Dreisaitl. Edmonton's got the puck here in the open ice. Nothing doing on that. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Minnesota's moving it into the offensive end. Oh, and that goes awry. Man, they create the scoring chance, and it's a good one, but they don't get it on the net. Quick pass to Bugstad. Under all sorts of pressure, trying to protect the puck. The Oilers will play it in their own end. And that pass goes off a stick. Puck grabbed by Merrill. Blacks it into the offensive zone. The Oilers have it now. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Getting a little too physical to maintain possession. Moves it quickly over to Goudreau. The Oilers gain possession in their own end. Gaining momentum along the wing. Players tell us all the time that they don't know where the next milestone is. That's garbage. They know when they're one goal away from a plateau. I think he's looking for it here. Denied by the puck stopper. There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. Just here in the late stages of this frame, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. The Oilers win the draw. Big time glove save! Talbot's able to make an outstanding save. His quickness and positioning give him the chance to even get a piece of this. Ryan's moving the puck through his own zone. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. Sent into the offensive zone. Pushes it across to Erickson Eck. Sends the cross ice pass. Not able to connect. Edmonton's got a hold of it along the wall. Works it across to Cassian. Handles the puck. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Shot deflected, denies him with the blocker, what a stop by Talbot. He's going to go back to the bench and want to look at that one again. He had enough time to really make a good shot. I don't think he quite got it where he wanted to. Minnesota's got the puck in the defensive end. Couldn't connect on that pass. Moves it to Ryan. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. Feeds the puck over to Ryan. Home stretch, 58 seconds. Couldn't find the intended target. Too much congestion in front. Tosses it to Fiala. Minnesota's got it into the offensive zone. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Denied by the goaltender. Talbot's on top of the puck, and that'll stop the play. Pretty conservative play here, James, as he covers it up to kill the play. Centers get set as they're ready to drop the puck again. Edmonton's got it, and they're on the attack. Glove saved by the goalie. Talbot's on top of that for the whistle. Pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. Here in the late going of the frame, it's all tied up. Nugent Hopkins has won the faceoff. And offside, we'll get a reset here. One possession. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Taken by Goligoski. Up along the wing. 
Great reach with the poke check by Archibald. Take it along the wall by Clefbaum. And the puck clears the zone. They'll be forced to leave as well. The Oilers win the faceoff. Picking up steam in the offensive zone. Shot! Oh, gets a blocker on it to turn it away. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. Easily turned aside by Talbot. And there's the buzzer. 60 minutes have been played, and we are still tied. Let's go to overtime, and we'll do that next here on EA Sports. Who's walking away with the W tonight? Overtime should give us an answer, and they're ready to drop the puck. Oh, the anticipation ramping up in this barn. You can just feel it right now. Moment of truth for both sides. Sudden death overtime. Let's get it on. Talbot's going to slow things down and up for the whistle. Oh, well, you got to kill the play eventually. That way everyone can get reorganized. Play set to resume with the faceoff ready to go. Minnesota's got a hold of the puck. The Oilers gain possession along the wall. A little crashing and banging forces the turnover. The Wild have the puck in their own end. Pass across to Spurgeon. Wrist shot from the slot. Shuts it down with the paddle. What a stop. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. The Oilers take possession off the faceoff. Here's a short pass to Hyman. Takes the feed. And he's able to handle that one. Covers it up and will get a stoppage in play. This is a faceoff. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Great read by the winger to take possession with the two centermen tied up. Shot! Stopped by the goaltender. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Hyman stick handling in his own zone. Edmonton's got the puck against the half wall. How did he stop that one? Sharp reaction save. A critical draw here. Bukestad's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Sends a pass over. Makes a move and the puck hops away from him. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. And he denied that opportunity. The goalie gets himself out of any potential trouble. Looking to end it! And he misses! We're still tied! And some good footwork to kick it away. The Wild have taken possession along the wall. Takes it to the net! Game on a stick! And he denies him with a monstrous save here in overtime! Down the right side and into the zone. Wrist one in front! Oh, a clutch save! He reacts late, but he makes the save through traffic. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. The Oilers take possession off the faceoff. Takes the pass. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Keeps hold of the puck. Rask's got it in the offensive end. Let's it fly. That's kicked away with the pad by Smith. Minnesota's got control of the puck. Fialo's got it in the defensive end. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. The Oilers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Puck scooped up by Rask. Nearing the final minute of OT. Dumba 
just gaining momentum. Centering pass, and that's blocked. Scooped up along the wall by Puyo Yarby. Edmonton's on the attack. Here's the pass. He scores! OT winner! The Oilers need it overtime, but they come away with the victory here. Just your head down and keep working. Now you get into the extra frame, you get your chance. You better not miss, and they didn't. They're feeling good about this one, and here they come back out onto the ice, Razor. Unreal support from their fans. They salute them a thank you for their efforts tonight. For Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us tonight.